Well, I thought I already started this video, but I went to check the camera and uh, it wasn't running. So, hey everybody, this is Mike with Monkey Fab. I just thought I had one of these uh, heat shields here to run. I figured I'd take you along to show you how it's done, um, but you already missed all the tacking up, uh, which is really not really all that eventful. But I'm using a number 12 GLS cup, uh, Thor 8 332 tungsten, 1 16th 308 filler wire, the metal's 304 stainless. And uh, we're at 100 amps and 20 CFH on the Argon. So, uh, we running? So, it looks like we're running this time. So, I'm going to uh, put you up here and you can just watch if you're so inclined. And maybe you just got to skip all the intro and stuff. So, maybe it's, maybe it's still interesting to you. I don't know. I don't know. Let's see. Can we zoom up on this? Turn it this way maybe a little bit. Is that a good angle? It's not bad. Okay. We'll see how this works. I also had the post blow cranked up pretty high, it's like 15 seconds, but that's just so I can manipulate the color of the weld. People seem to like it, uh, kind of a mix of silver and purples and blues and whatever, so give them what they want.
All right, so that's all there is to it. And uh, I just weld this uh, without virgin or anything. And uh, the idea is just don't get so hot that you burn through and it goes just fine. And the copper on the back helps it, uh, one, dissipate heat, which uh, helps manipulate the colors and also, uh, and also backs, kind of backs the stainless a little bit and makes an excellent ground. So uh, that's how it is. Be sure to go to my website, monkeyfabgarage.com. Check out my uh, deals on Blue Demon welding supplies. Um, I went live with that maybe like a day ago a day ago and like sold out like that and i was shocked because i always totally overstock on everything like i got this pile of wastegate stuff and i got a pile of some flanges and i just have like money wrapped up in inventory so i usually am retarded and i buy way more because i always think i have a great idea and it usually isn't that great of an idea but it eventually works uh but anyway uh, sold out like almost immediately on the TIG, the TIG welder starter kits. So same day, ordered uh, new batches. They're supposed to be in the mail today. So the lady said hopefully they'll be there by Monday. They should be in by Monday. So if you order those kits, um, then just realize that uh, they'll ship Monday. Uh, and I appreciate you guys. I really appreciate you guys' support because it means a lot to me, you know. Uh, it really does. So hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you learned something. And uh, thanks for tuning in to Monkey Fat. This is Mike signing out.